previously on Horizon Forbidden West. That must be chain scrape. Drew said I could get my bow upgraded in there. By the forge. Petra? Aloy, what are you doing here? Uh, Petra, Petra. I'm just passing through. Ah, of course. Bigger gears to grind. If you want a cold beer and a few laughs with an old friend, come find me at the brewery. Your choice. Well, this old one guy sounds like trouble. Maybe Petra could use some support. But first things first, I need to find that workbench and upgrade my bow. Shop looks closed. Yep. Can I still use the workbench? I ain't gonna stop you. Hey, Milda. I took some of your stew last time I went into the wilds. Kept me going for a week. Felt like I could have put a strider in a sleeper hole. Your last customer mentioned your cooking really kept him going out in the wild. Where I'm headed, I could use some of that. But my special groove griddle is no more. Without it, I can't cook any of my signature dishes. What do you need? For the ingredients. A few pieces of decent wild meat, and I'd say a big handful of bitter leaf stems. That'll do. As for the griddle, a corrugated metal panel might suffice until I can have a new one forged. You'd likely find one in the scrounger pile if you follow the river to the northeast. Don't worry, I'll clean it first. <laughs> I think I have everything you asked for. Then just as you have inspired me, let us see if I can return the favor. Time to cook. Next time you want the best provisions, you know where to find me. And your next order of any dish will be on the house. <laughs> Thanks. What is up, Rocket Nation? Welcome back to the channel. Hopefully you guys are having the best day ever in the history of ever. Today, we're back at it again with more Horizon Forbidden West. The goal today, at least my goal as of right now, can always change at any point in time. But the goal is to, uh, there was at least a couple of more side quests that are available in uh, this little town here. And I would like to go around and get uh, at least one or two of those done. So that's the goal for today. But I want to say thank you guys so much for joining me. I appreciate you guys. That all, it's all you guys that keep coming back day in, day out. It just blows my mind. All I can say is I appreciate you guys so much. And uh, with all that out of the way, let's get into it. I present to you episode number five of Horizon Forbidden West. All right, so here we are in Chain Scrape, and what a wonderful freaking view that is right there. Like, this game is truly gorgeous, without a doubt. I just, sometimes I'm just, I'm, I just find myself just standing here, panning the camera around, looking at, I don't know what it is. I don't know if it, it somehow feels like there's a depth to the world. I don't know if that makes sense to anybody. But uh, I feel like there's definitely a depth to the world, and it's a more realistic depth. It almost, it feels like we're, instead of a backdrop sitting in the back, it feels like you're looking out into a world that is, uh, yeah, absolutely love it. But there is a couple of side quests that we have to do. One of them is going to be down here. Let's actually open up the map. Is it in town here? Yeah, it looks like it is in town. Um, Let's go and find out what this one is. I do at one point want to see if we can't find Petra inside of the uh, inside of the bar. Oh, right here. Here's the quest. I hope Corvin and the others are doing better than I am. Corvin and the others, he says. All right, let's see what's up with this guy. Arnuf. What happened to you? That damn mine is what happened to me. <clears throat> it won't be the last injury if Olven keeps shoving those tongs into those tunnels. What mine? Northeast to chain scrape where the river ends. I told Corvin we should stop when the first cave in happened, but <sighs> Olven probably threatened to cut off her pay. Or worse. How about you slow down and take me through it? This Olven guy does not seem like a good person. We're gonna have to deal with him at some point. Um let's go with this. Your injury? You mentioned you were injured in a cave-in. Yeah, <clears throat> a couple days ago. That's how I hurt this blasted leg. <laughs> Corvin and the others were opening a new vein while I was checking on an older one. As soon as their blast hit, Tunnel I was in collapsed. Might have dodged it if I wasn't running on barely a spark of sleep. We were pushing too hard and too fast. 
And you're afraid Corvind and the others might not be as lucky if it happens again. Mm-hmm. Hit the nail right on the head. Wow, the facial animations and everything are so good. Who's Corvind? He's our foreman, and a damn good one. The kind that knows how to deal with management when it gets unreasonable. But Olvind, <laughs> his demands go beyond unreasonable. Corvin's been doing his best to appease him. He even blamed himself for my injury when it was Olvin who ordered the extra shifts. Sounds like a good guy. That's why we all put up with the long hours and lousy conditions. But if the whole mine becomes unstable, I'd rather suffer Olvin's wrath than die buried in rubble. Man, what about this Olvin guy? Tell me more about him. How come Olvin's in charge? Don't these mines belong to the Karja? Try telling Olvin that. He brought in all the back in to get them open. Might as well own them. <laughs> Fire and spit. You ask him. He owns us as well. Yeah, this guy's a piece. All right, might be able to help. I could check in on your crew if I'm in the area. I would appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, yeah. We're definitely, let's go ahead and open this one up. Deep Trouble, side quest, level five. An, injury, an injured Asaram miner is worried about the rest of his crew who have been working under dangerous conditions. Go to the mine. Absolutely. Let's mark that one as active right now. Um, also, I do believe we had, didn't we have a job? Nora anointed, gather the resources needed to upgrade this item. Okay, so now we're able to just go to a workbench and we can upgrade. Um, I believe we were trying to upgrade the, uh, a piece of armor. I believe it was the armor that we're actually using. So let's make our way to the workbench here real fast. We'll do that and then we'll make our way over there. Um, does this guy got shops closed, Red? Okay, You're welcome to use the work pitch. Okay. He called me Red. Uh, <laughs> oh. oh, we could do pouch upgrades as well. Oh, no way. Food pouch upgrade. Oh, this is this is where it's at right here. Um, food pouch. Oh yeah, this is so we need fox fox, squirrel hide, boar hide, squirrel bone, boar bone. Raccoon hide. Okay. Um, we definitely want more of the... We need to kill as many raccoons as humanly possible. <laughs> You're a horrible person! I'm not, I swear! I don't want to kill them. I have to for my arrows. We need as many of those as possible. Um, bomb satchel. Trap pow... Oh, 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 that needs to happen. But for right now... Uh, we have an upgrade for our gear. Uh, this is the final piece. This is going to bring concentration regen to plus two. I don't know what plus two means. I don't know what that means uh, as far as real world uh, concentration regen. I don't know what, you know, how does that affect it? But it looks like we have some weaves, which I think are mods for the game as well. So let's go ahead and get this out of the way here. And then the next one we need... Fanghorn antler. So we got to find some fanghorns pronto. Take them out. We got one. Oh, we, if we're going in the direction, I think we're going. We may. Okay. Create a job. Yes. Job created. Nice. Oh, I love the jobs. I love making the jobs because it's like you're creating your own quest, you know? Um, all right. So which way are we supposed to head out here? Okay. We're going out. I'm just going to say, I think that we're going to be heading back towards the east. I'm thinking we're going upstream this way. Yes, we are. Okay, that's perfect because there is some fanghorns in this direction. I am just absolutely in love with this game. I am trying to nail down the... I am trying to nail down the, uh, the audio a bit as far as the... Because you can really do some fine tuning when it comes to the audio as well. And I'm... Ooh, nice. I, that made me sad. Um, awesome. Just got some boar hide right there. But I'm trying to nail... You can do some fine tuning as to how loud the uh, machines and everything are. So I'm trying to get some, right some of the you. fine tuning done. Yeah, get over here. 
Did we knock it off? Yes, we did. We did knock it off. What? Oh, Jesus. That came out of nowhere. Not really out of nowhere. I mean, he was definitely telegraphed. Lift up. What? I need it to lift up so I can shoot it under under throat. Where did the other one go? What? That a boy. Okay, that one's dead now. Wow, that was really close. Oh, I'm out of ammo. That, that didn't do damage. Oh, there's iframes. There's iframes on the slide now. No way. That's huge. That's actually huge. But. Got it. Nice. Look at this board just sat here while we got in a fight. Got it. Right in the butthole. All right. Nice. So there are iframes when doing the, uh, when doing a slide, which that was not like that in the previous game. Yes, there's the sound shell right there. And here's another sound shell. I do wish that there was, I know that there is a setting where you can remove the animation of bending over and picking stuff up, but, um, I wonder if there is a setting for uh, an area loot. If not, I feel like this game definitely needs an area loot. You knock so many pieces off. Or was that? I heard, I thought I heard a raccoon. Ain't this it enough? Oh, uh, we do need. Got him. I do need me a, oh, right here. Here's these, here's these. Now these are fang horns, right? Oh, yes, it is. It's a fire fang horn. Um, let's get in position. We're going to try and take out, try and take, we need the horns off of these. So freeze bomb. All right. Already frozen. There's one horn down. Oh. Hey, we got it down. Is the other one going to make its move? I think the other one's, yeah, right there's the other one. Let's take out this one's horn. Oh, that missed bad. There's one horn there. I think it's gone. That'd be a long shot. So right here is our two horns here. So now we already have enough to go ahead and do an upgrade as well. There's its other horn. I love the idea that they did that. It adds so much more. It's not just go and kill every single um, machine that you come across as quickly as you can. You really have to think about it because you want to get the parts off for upgrades. Time to fight. He's just standing there, ain't he? Well, I almost feel bad now. 
All right. Well, there's the last of the horns. Well, that's why I was hoping that it was going to be in this direction because I knew that there was uh, some of these fang horns over here. So we already got some fang horns. That does have a resource container on it as well. That all the pieces I knocked off. Yeah, I think it is. This is just some bitter. Do something with this. Some bitter weed. A bitter leaf. Oh, right there. Got him. Hey. All right. So, where are we heading now? They see us across the way. Oh, no. I have the wrong thing marked. I have the wrong thing marked right now. All right. Quest. Main side, deep trouble. That's what we're on. So deep trouble was not in this direction at all. It looks like, oh yeah, it was. Okay. All right. Beautiful. We are going to have to go this way. I guess, uh, off its horn oh we never even we didn't even have one of these done yet but I just hear something else to the I thought I heard something else to the right of us okay we got off both of its horns um if I see another one I'm actually gonna we'll actually go in and look at it and see what parts I'm assuming it's the horns that you get off of it yeah, right there. All right, so a herd machine that digs up natural resources to convert into biofuel. Although easily startled, it will defend itself before eventually fleeing. A mountable machine, weak versus shock, and the resources that we are going to get that are detachable are going to be its horns and the blaze canister as well. And the blaze canister is destroyed when they are killed as well, so... You really have to choose. Do you want the horns or do you want the blaze canisters? Can we hide in this? Oh, I'm out of ammo. The other ones are up top there. I think we're good. And we got the blaze canister. So you can actually take out the blaze canister too. Hey, we got another level up. Holla. Two skill points. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. All right. So we were working our way down the hunter tree here. So we want to take Val. Oh, wait. No, not the Valor Surge. Oh, yeah. Valor Surge Master. Passive boost. Build up Valor faster. Activate your equipment Valor Surge by opening... The weapon wheel, L1, and then tapping R1 for a unique and powerful special ability. So with this, we unlock our Valor Surge. Nice. So bolster your resolve and deal more damage with ranged weapons for a limited time. Ranged weapon damage plus 30% health recovery per hit, 5%. Um, you have unlocked your first Valor Surge. Hold square to equip it. Boom. Well, that is awesome. Okay. Um, And we have another point of ill. Not enough skill points. Oh, these cost two skill points for these ones. All right. So the regular nodes cost one. The other ones cost two. That's stamina regen. That is going to be for use with uh, these skills here, I do believe. The weapon techniques. So can you have more than one technique avail or, uh, activated at one point in time or no? Probably not, but I guess we're going to find out. You know what I think we should do, too? Since we have a free point, we should probably go into the survival tree. Increase the effectiveness of healing and potions and gain benefits while in low health. Includes weapon techniques for blast slings and shredder gauntlets. I don't know what a shredder gauntlet is, but yeah, potent medicine right here. Medicinal berries provide more healing and heal you faster. Tap up to he without a doubt. 100% yes. That needs to happen. 
Um, so what is the Valor Surge for this? Consume a special potion and to restore health and gain resistance and to uh, status effects. Wow. You re health regained every two seconds, 30. And then melee damage resistance of 15%. It looks like, can you upgrade these further too? It looks like you can. Yeah, for three points, you can upgrade it even further. 45%. Wow. And weapon technique damage goes up 20% and weapon stamina regen goes up 100%. Oh, wow. These are going to be really powerful. Um, low health regen automatically recover health sooner when in the critical state. Resist more damage when in the critical health state. Medicinal. Yeah. Medicine capacity right now only having 10. That's not great. It looks like there might be more than one level to a lot of these as well. Wow. Okay. So, um, definitely some things. Valor on impact. Gain valor when you hit enemies. Oh, that's nice. Potion proficiency. Bouncing bomb. Triple shredder. These, this is low health regen. Potent medicine there again as well. Low health ranged, low health melee, valor on impact, power shredder, plant forager. Oh, gather more resources from plants. Oh, I almost want to mainline my way to that. Medicine capacity again. Low health melee and ranged, low health defense. So what is this way down over here then for this one? Ammo expert. Heavy weapon. Ooh, heavy weapons. I do like that. Concentration plus again there. Wow. Okay. So there's a lot. They have put a lot into this. Workbench expert. Craft ammunition at a workbench using less resources than in the wild. Oh, that seems super useful. Oh, yeah. That's quite a ways down this tree as well. All right, so you, there's a lot. There's a lot. Without a doubt, there's a whole lot. I'm super excited. Um, wow, they've done just such a good job. All right, well, we're 260 meters away. Let's get on the move here. Is this new machines up here or no? Let's grab some wood on our way. We have been using up a little bit here and there. No, these are... Let's get the blaze off of all three of these. What? How'd that miss? Um, activate your currently selected Valor Surge by opening up the weapon wheel L1 and tapping R1. Build up Valor uh, Surge by fighting enemies. So we are now full. Our Valor Surge is full. You can see it in the lower right-hand cor corner. So you see there's a little purple bar. I'm thinking that must be what we're filling up, the Valor. But we got uh, all three of their canisters off of them. See, so even if you don't actually kill the uh, the machine... Smoke. Coming from where Arnav said I'd find his crew. Oh no. Uh oh, that's not a good sign. This must be the mine Arnav told me about. It looks like the miners are in trouble. I am getting us out of this. I promise. Oh that no. looks like the foreman Arnav mentioned. I should check in with him. Founder becoming hunted. All right, this is the foreman. You good? I, I'm okay. Thank you, Corvin. Corvin, Arnav sent me. I'm not, not now. Oh. Easy. What happened? Explosion in the mine. Water flooded the whole place. Some of my guys are still. 
They're still down there. I can't, I can't stop. You've done enough. Are you hurt? Are you hurt? I'm... I'll live. The others. Please. I need to know exactly what happened. We use controlled blast to open up new veins in the mountain. One of them must have gone wrong. I can't... I have to go. Uh, how many are down there? How many are still down there? Corvent, how many? Uh... Two. Two, I think. Two more. I'll do what I can. All right, let's do this. And I said that it was flooded. Crimson Narrows. Gotta find those two miners, quick. Oh, yep, it's definitely flooded. There we go. They're alive. Oh, you can boost yourself. Oh, that's awesome. The miners. One of them doesn't look too good. I'm starting to see things. Are you okay? Who are you? Corvin sent me. Are you hurt? Uh, my leg. I... I was a little too close to the blast. What happened? We were blasting in the farthest tunnel, but the scaffolding didn't hold. It collapsed. I... I think it blocked the drainage shaft. Water started flooding the place as quick as I drink ale. I barely managed to drag us here. So something's keeping the water inside the tunnels. What are you thinking? I've got an idea. Are there more explosives? Are you crazy? Yeah, she'll still be some up top, but you'll need these fuses. Are you crazy? <laughs> you can't move, and I'm not leaving you here. It's not like she can make things worse. Don't go anywhere. Uh, it looks like I we're gonna to find whatever's blocking that drainage shaft and blow it sky high. Yeah. Hopefully without bringing the mine down on top of me. Oh, it's very hard to swim here. It won't let me swim through. Yeah, I can't make it through there. Like fighting against the current, I can't make it by it. Boost me. Almost there. Wow, that was a fight. Good oh. Lord. <sighs> Made it. There's the debris blocking the shaft. If I can reach those explosives up on that track, maybe I can blast through the blockage. Can we jump to this? No. I think I'm gonna have to climb back up over here in order to make it. Get up there. Oh, I see there's another container up top there as well. There is some stuff over here. Just got to find a way up. Whew, well, that'll keep me awake. All right, where do we go from here, though? 
We aren't getting up that way. I'm so confused. <laughs> oh, back up, up, thank you, thank you. Oh, I see, I see. There's a rope ladder there. So we're gonna have to get that swung around. How do we get it? Can we actually get a hit on it from over here is the question. All right, let's climb up. Get her up there. No, see, we can't actually reach it from here. Well, how the heck? It's too far away. So we're gonna have to be a lot closer to that. Um, okay, I'm super confused as to where I'm supposed to go now. <laughs> if I can't reach this over here, I, I don't think that's the way you're supposed to be able to do that. <laughs> but sometimes you outthink the thinkers <laughs> with action. Um, I'm super confused as to where I'm supposed to go. I don't know where from. Can we climb up over here? No, because... All right. Well, I don't know where to... I see there's definitely climbing points along the inside here. I just don't know how to get up to them. Yeah, we can't... Why did she just jump back in? I literally wasn't moving. Um, yeah. Kind of lost as, oh, right up there. There was another ladder. Get her up there. Why are you climbing so slow? <laughs> Worst climber ever. What are you... Oh. For worse. There's another one over there too. So there's three total. Just go ahead and tag it. Fire could do a lot of damage. Maybe. What? <laughs> I couldn't hear you because I just dumped you in the water. Running low on oxygen. Can we get up out right here? Yes, we can. We got it. We got it. Oh, the upgrading this bow was probably the best choice that we made early. We got it. It's dead. The other one has to know now, right? Oh, yeah, there it is. Um, What is this stuff? Is that that was that the music or was that that sound that he was making? <laughs> what? It was already done swinging and I Okay, we got him. I think that's all of them. Now to find a way out of this room. Okay, what are these things here? Mature fungus can be struck to release a cloud of spores that may obstruct visual detection. Oh, that's brilliant. Way up to those explosives. Oh, that's actually brilliant. All right, we got a lot of these little sound things. Yeah, sound shell, burrower sound shells. Yep, 
Yeah, we need an area loot button pronto. I think that's everything, though. We should follow those tracks. See if they lead to the explosives. What tracks? Oh, these tracks. Oh, these tracks. Well, it's a good thing she's paying attention. Let's see where this leads. It leads to this box. Put it all in my pockets. Another one right there. Definitely getting all the loot. Oh, look at all this stuff. Good Lord. Jackpot right there. There's the explosives up on the track. Just need to get across somehow. Now we got our ladder down. And this will get us across. Now we can go up. And then there's this right here. Uh, detonate explosives. Why not? Let her rip. I should have looted all the stuff first, right? Dang it, why didn't I loot the stuff first? I'm gonna blow it up! <laughs> we did it! There it is! No, don't climb down! There was loot up the there. Oh, guess that got its attention. What? an end to it oh jesus we took a big hit there oh uh, let's go ahead and fill up on these real quick oh where did you come from get up you gotta move you can't stand around but oh, no wrong You know what? Let's use this. Let's use this Valor Surge. Well, that was big boy damage. Wow. That's all of them. Now let's go check on those miners. It was actually terrifying. All right, we got to definitely get our loot on too. There was some more supply crates that were up top that I definitely want to be able to get. So much junk. How is she carrying this all around? <laughs> so much. That is clearly going to be movable, right? No. <laughs> Yeah, you can totally pull this. Uh, it's stuck. Can't pull it from here. What? Get it over here. Come here. Release the pole caster. Step away to pull. Now we can just pull it, grab it, and move it. 
I think we're gonna move it up here. Release the crate. All right, there was more stuff for us to loot down here too. Uh, that was really cool when you, she did the Valor Surge and like painted her face. That was kind of awesome. Oh, we can pull these too. There's a ladder up above. Can we jump to it? Oh, we totally can. <gasps> nice. Um, but I want to get to the other. Like there was some more. Yeah, there's loot up top there I want to get to. And there was some more up top that way I want to get to. Can I just jump up to that? Yes, I can. Which we already got to that one. How do we get to this one right here? What? I just fell. Let's take this across. Okay, we can see that one. Why are you climbing? Nope, that's not going to work. So we have to go up top. Climb. Are we going to have to go all the way back around? Oh, I should have totally did it. I should have looted it before I blew everything up. Jesus. Wow, look at it. This place is totally different without the water. Oh, what's down there? Oh. What is this? All right, get back to the surface before you drown. What a very cool quest this has been so far. I'm really liking this one. This one's really good. Another container right here. So it's a good thing we did have to come down here anyways. Boy, if you did not use your, uh, your sight, you would have never known there was all this to climb on. The focus is, yeah, next level, climb or climb. All right, so now this way will lead us back around. You know, you can, the appreciation that I have for something that's so small essentially just a side quest a mine in a side quest and uh the attention to detail that they put into it is uh yeah next level all right so now we're jumping to this please don't miss it and then we'll go up top from here and now we can get this one over here on the side right there can we just pull it Um, I wonder if we just pull this off. Yeah, I'm thinking that's what we do. You just pull it down. And I'm guessing we're probably going to end up doing the same with this one over here. That one's too far away, though. Uh, how can we safely make our way down? <laughs> I feel like... I feel like this is a death jump. I don't think there is a safe way down from here, is there? So maybe jump to this. We're still too far away to be able to grab that. Oh, 
here's this container here. Oh, wow. Look at all this stuff in it. Yeah, we got a bunch of stuff out of there. Nice. And then I suppose. Nope. Nope. There we go. I'm thinking if we come out to the edge here. Yep, there it is. That's how you do it. Nice. Boy, that grappling hook definitely, uh, it adds a whole other dimension. That's for sure. Some more valuables there. That's the way out. So I think we're set here. Wow, there was actually a lot to look around for in here. This this was freaking awesome. All right, let's go uh see if the boys are okay. She's so dead. We don't know that. I'm not dead. That looks like you did it. I thought you blew yourself up. Are you two okay from here? I can get this idiot down. Don't you worry. Thanks, kid. Kid? Did he just call me kid? Thanks, kid. All right. All right. All right. Better let Corvin know his men are all right. We just participated in a mine rescue. Come on. Up we go. Uh, I think we got everything else. Yeah, I think we're good to go. Oh, well, what an awesome freaking quest. I can't wait to hear uh, Corvin's reaction. Hopefully they'll stop working for this butthole. We're going to have to go deal with that guy next. Olvind, we got to go deal with him next. Look at how he got up and came over to us. I found the two you mentioned. They're safe, but could probably use a hand. Is that everyone? <sighs> it is. I dread to think what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. I knew we were blasting too much, but the man who staked the claim here, Ulvand, he kept pushing and pushing me. I tried to shield my crew from his constant demands every damn day. I... I should have been stronger. You were there for your crew when they needed you. That counts for something. Ulvand can threaten me all he wants. I am not letting my people back into those mines. Will you be all right? Yes. I can take it from here. You are owed, Huntress. Deep trouble, side quest Olden's completed. Keeps coming up, and it's never good. Sooner or later, someone's gonna have to deal with him. There it is. Face paint unlocked. Asaram Artificer. Interesting. Face paint. Uh, what is? He has an exclamation point. Let's see what he has to say. Thank you, Huntress. I'll see the last two make it out. Hmm, I wonder why he's got the... Thank you, Huntress. I'll see the last two make it out. I wonder why he's got the exclamation point over his head. Corvind. Well, that was absolutely freaking awesome, if I must say. There is a... Uh... Save these for when I need it. It looks like there's a... Yeah, there is a campfire right here. That's awesome. Oh, and what is this? Unavailable, it says. I felt like I hit him right in the chesticles. You like that, little scumbag? <laughs> Here we can shoot that one in the butt spot, right? Oh, that was a miss. Need ammo? Turn around and face me. I need you to lift up. We didn't get his special spot.
What? Oh, I feel like I missed that one too. So we only got one of their uh, sound shells. Boy, once you kill something, there's so much to go around and loot. That's why I think an area loot would have been very, very useful in this game, without a doubt. Some stuff across the river too. That's a charger. like the ballerina of chargers but that missed oh no i missed the way that they fall down when you hit them it's absolutely awesome And we put him down. Nice. Well done. Oh, did we just, I think we just got a mod. This, oh, a coil is now available in your inventory. Unlock coil slots on your weapons by upgrading them. Equip coils you loot or purchase to improve your weapons performance. Nice. Why is this unavailable? Though so, I don't understand that. What is this? Got another level up too. Oh, we might as well jump in and spend that point. I think we're going to go... I think we're going to push further down the uh, survival tree. Low health defense. Low health regen. Medicine capacity. Potion proficiency. I feel like uh, let's go down this side here. Let's go down this side because we can definitely use more medicine capacity. And then, uh, yeah, Valoran impact. And then we can start shooting down... We'll probably go this way again for medicine, potent medicine. And then we're going to work our way to this. I want plant forager like right now. For any other lootables. Plenty over here. So how many we can carry 12, I do believe right now, 12 of the uh, of the berries. All right, let's see what's up with this place. I don't know why we can't use it. Uh, quick save. There it is. All right, you know what? I think this is a good spot to stop for the day. Let's get a better view. Oh, there's a good view. There's something for you guys to look at. All right, thank you guys so much for joining me for yet another episode of Horizon Forbidden West. As always, if you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Share it on your favorite social media platform if you want others to enjoy it as well. And if you would like to be notified when the next episode goes live, all you got to do is be subscribed to the channel, click the little bell notification icon deal thing, and YouTube will take care of the rest. Thank you all so much. I'm absolutely loving this game, and I'm so happy I get to bring this to you guys. Uh, hopefully you're enjoying it as well. Uh, as always, remember, life is short. Pause save, and I will see you in the next episode.